Good morning, interwebs. It is 3.15 in the morning and it's Wednesday. In case you're trying to keep track of what day it is, because the way that these have been going up, it's difficult to uh, figure out. Hold on, my computer just made that noise, meaning that it's time to put the vlog for tonight up. So I'll be right back. Alrighty, so now the vlog is uploading. We'll see how long it claims it's gonna take. Right now it's saying 11, 12, it's counting up in minutes. So we'll see where it ends up if I, I should probably be waiting it out before I go to sleep. Because like I said, it's only 3.17. Anyways. I've been thinking today that I needed to film a vlog because I have not for the last two days. And so I've spent a lot of my time while I was working on my scrap stash blanket and stuff today, thinking about number one, what I wanted to talk about in the vlog, and number two, why I haven't been posting a lot and all the things. So what I have come to the conclusion about is part of the reason I have not vlogged in the last two days or a lot lately. It's just that I am not super happy with how I am spending my time and thus I don't feel like I want to share that and the stuff that I am doing that I feel is productive or just like stuff where I do feel like I'm spending my time in the right places is all in areas of my life that I do not talk about on the vlog. So that um that kind of factors into things. Also <laughs> I have become acutely aware of the fact that people watch the vlog. Like, I know you all exist and like are real people and there's a really freaking loud cricket in my house. Like there's two or three of them, but one of them is just acting up in the last like 10 minutes. So yeah, if you see it, can you kill it or take it outside or something? Cause my cats can't seem to figure that out. But anyways, I've become acutely aware that people um, watch the vlog and comment on the vlog and just kind of just generally exist, which is good and I like having people watch and I mean, I wouldn't put things out there if I didn't want them to be watched and commented upon. However, <laughs> I sometimes find that I have to put a lot of thought into how and what I say because I know that a lot of people are watching. So a lot is obviously a relative term just in general and even within our like community because a lot fewer people watch me than watch a lot of other people but then again a lot more watch than watch some other things and the people who watch are very um, loyal and watch like through to the end my retention rate is ridiculously high like in the high 60s which is yeah, kind of crazy, um, which if you don't understand what that means, then it's really not important. If you do, then you're probably like, wow, good times, which I think good times too. But so yeah, so I'm just aware of what I'm, of like what I say and the fact that people are listening and stuff. And so I don't want what I say to be misconstrued. And I also feel like a lot of times in my life, not just in the social media-ish world, but just in general, of late, like anytime I do something good, which I feel like I'm having a great deal of difficulty finding the energy to do the good, motivated, like productive, I keep using that word and that's not the word I mean, but like the things, um, when I do a thing, I do a good, um, I feel like there's just immediate, ooh, but more, ooh, it's not good enough, ooh, we want more of that show us more, take us more, do it again, do this other thing that's associated with it. And it's like, seriously, life, just be freaking content with what you get, right? Um, and I feel this way across the board with like all humans I've been interacting with lately. Um, so I just, it's kind of exhausting and it has come to my mind a decent amount when it comes to sitting down to film vlogs or clips or to think about it. Cause it's like, well, gosh, if I show myself doing this one thing, everyone's just going to say they want to see more of that. Or they want to see, I didn't do enough of it, or I didn't show it in the right way or whatever. And I just don't care. Like you get what you get and you don't get upset. And if you don't like it, move along. And that's definitely like how I feel about it. But then I kind of feel like a jerk for feeling that way and certainly like a jerk for saying it. But it's also really super exhausting to feel that way. <laughs> Anyways, I have been having a decent amount of thoughts and feelings about 
the filming of things and I do still think that like vlogging is a good thing for me and it's good for me to talk to the camera and whatever but I feel like there's the constant worry in me and I know that a lot of it comes from me and not from anybody else but that I have to explain myself for my actions or what I'm saying or have some sort of like I don't know Anyways, I don't know that any of this is making much sense and I'm gonna have to piece it together because I've had to like pause to compose my thoughts multiple times and yeah. And to not to go and hunt down that cricket. That's also been a thing. Um, but anyways, I, yeah. There's just been a lot going on in my head and um, some of it has to do with filming the vlog and the weird thing I've been doing the last this is now the beginning of year three um I put a lot of myself out there and just consumed by people who I do not necessarily know much about which is fine I don't know that I have the bandwidth to know as much about all of you as all of you know about me but sometimes I think people think they know more about me than they do. Same thing happens in my offline life. There are lots of people who think they know things about me that they don't because you're like related or live in the same community or something. But if you don't live in somebody's house or frankly inside their head, you don't know all the things you think you know about them. Um, so it just gets exhausting and stressful and yeah, I've just been contemplative and aware of it and yeah. And I don't really know what kind of response I want or any response, I don't know. I'm sure I'm gonna get a response of some sort and whatever it is, whatever. <laughs> That's kind of where I'm at on a lot of things in life. I'm just like, whatever. It's gonna, it'll all shake out. So, anyways, I filmed the vlog of me sitting and talking and being kind of grumpy again, like I was when I did my Sunday sunrise, which I had to put off filming because I was just like, yeah, having difficulty creating goals for myself because I was in a very negative headspace. So all of the goals were like, you know, I talk about how it's important to word things, you know, like semantics matter. So it's important to word things in a way that is kind to yourself or like that you can actually achieve. Well, I was having difficulty coming up with ideas or things to word in a way that was at all positive or at all. So, yeah, just, yeah. Anyways. <laughs> Hopefully, I don't know, I can piece something together out of all of this because I had a lot to say and I had to wait till I had the energy to like sit down and film and you know, till I kind of hit that deadline where I had to do it now or end up skipping another day. My video is now processing at 95% behind you so as soon as I get this done I guess I can go to sleep which would probably be a good thing if I can fall asleep because we got things to do tomorrow. We have things to do today. There's always things, right? Tomorrow we have to go on a cricket hunt, apparently. There's a bunch of crickets. It got super wet in our basement and so some crickets came upstairs and they weaseled their way in. But anyways, I'm gonna go and hit publish on the vlog for tonight. And then in a different headspace tomorrow, the next day at some point, I will edit this video and potentially take lots of it out or leave lots of it in. I don't know what I'll think then because who knows what Kendra of the future is going to feel like. What Kendra, not who, what, where, I don't know. One of those things. There's going to be a Kendra of the future and she's going to have an opinion about what I had to say and she's going to uh, edit accordingly. <laughs> Alrighty, hope you all are having a time at whatever time you are consuming this content. And I will see you all tomorrow. Nighty night.